trained to pass the 40 mile an hour offset crash test by IIHS, okay? So when that crash test first came out, they were crashing the vehicle on the driver's side at 40% of the body. So you'd figure right about in here is where the collision took place, all right? Then what IIHS did is they stepped it up. Now they do the crash at 20% of the body. Same impact, same speed, but only 20% of the body. Well, you can imagine what it does to the vehicle. It just basically totals this out, takes the wheel, and shoves it up into the passenger cabin. So very few cars have passed this new crash test. Obviously, the TL did, and there's a Volvo S90 that's passed it. Okay, Very few vehicles because it's such a severe crash test. This vehicle has been designed to pass that new crash test. And what you're seeing is you're seeing a lot more reinforcing here in the corners. All right, so a lot, they use high strength steel, what they call hot stamp steel. In this corner, there's a beam here, and then there's another beam that goes underneath the light that comes up, joins, and then goes up the A-pillar. So by having that much more steel in those areas, it allows the vehicle to pass that test, okay? So that's what's unique about this vehicle. And like I say, not very many vehicles have done very well in that. If your vehicle hasn't been redesigned since 2012, the chances of you passing it are slim to none because it takes a substantial amount of additional steel in the vehicle to uh, pass it. And that's one of the things they've done. Now to counteract that, by putting more steel in the body, you have to lower the weight. So you'll see that the hood is made of aluminum. The fender, front fenders are aluminum. You'll notice that the door skins are also aluminum. The front bumper beam is made out of aluminum. And the bracing that goes underneath the dash that holds the steering column in place, it is also made of aluminum. So we add a lot of steel in this area. We take a lot of weight out in other areas. Of it, all right? So those are the, some of the things that they've done to the vehicle to allow for the safety.